how does the heat energy get from the sun to the earth so this is a very important concept there are no particles between sun and the earth so it cannot travel by conduction or convection so by what method it travels it travels by radiation okay very important thing so this is short wave radiation when it enters the earth atmosphere that will be long wave radiation and it uh, we will discuss it in the radiation slides okay now these are certain questions radiation travels in straight lines true radiation can travel through vacuum true radiation requires particles to travel for actually it will be radiation requires particle to travel it is here this is the correct one radiation travels at the speed of light true okay so the radiation requires particles to travel no it doesn't require any particles to travel okay so the false is the correct answer otherwise it wouldn't have come from sun towards earth there is no particle there okay as you can see in the previous slide there is vacuum here no particles no particles it wouldn't have come from sun to earth had there been any any particle okay so let's okay so four containers filled with warm water which container would have the warmest water after 10 minutes shiny metal dull metal dull black or shiny black let's see the shiny metal container would be the warmest after 10 minutes because its shiny surface uh, surface reflects heat radiation back into the container so less is lost the dull black container would be the coolest because it is the best at emitting heat radiation so what he is saying that the shiny metal the shiny metal container would be the warmest the shiny metal container would be the warmest because its shiny surface surface reflects heat radiation it is reflecting whereas the dull black is actually emitting the heat okay it is only emitting the heat and the amount of radiation that is falling over the black surface if it is a complete black surface it will absorb everything okay so that's why okay so let's go to the next slide absorption experiment just now i have told you the absorption experiment the four containers were placed equidistant from a heater which container would have the warmest after 10 minutes shiny metal dull metal dull black and the shiny black the options are again same the dull black container would be the warmest after 10 minutes because its surface absorbs heat radiation the best the shiny metal container would be the coolest because it is the poorest at the heat radiation okay okay convection questions now let's uh, since we have already uh, since i have already told you about the convection i have shown you some animations of radiation uh, of convection as well as of conduction okay so let's discuss about the questions why does the hot air rise and cold air sink cool air is more dense as uh, as i have already told you the cooler air is more dense than warm air so the cool air falls through the warm air and since we cannot have vacuum naturally so definitely the cool air comes to take the place of uh, to uh, to take the place of the warm air that has gone up due to density reduction why are boilers placed beneath hot water tanks in people's homes let's see hot water rises so when the boiler heats the water and the hot water rises the water tank is filled with hot water okay why are the houses painted white in hot countries white reflects heat radiation just now we have seen and keeps the house cooler why are shiny foil blankets wrapped around marathon runners at the end of a race the shiny metal reflects the heat radiation from the runner back in this stops the runner getting cold okay it's just you know the shiny part you know the reflect uh, it reflects more so that's why more of more amount of heat gets wiped off okay so let's have these multiple choice questions which of the following is not a method of heat transfer which of the following is not a method of heat transfer radiation insulation conduction and convection and it is pretty sure that it has to be b insulation insulation is a kind of material 
that doesn't have free electrons that has free electrons but the uh, they have more stable electrons than the unstable ones in which of the following are the particles closest together so it has to be solid okay it has to be solid okay how does heat energy reach the earth from the sun so it has to be radiation okay which is the best surface for reflecting heat radiation so it has to be shiny white which is the best surface for absorbing heat radiation so it has to be dull black as i have already told you